This was brought to you by The Strange, The Bizarre, The Unusual, I Like It. On YouTube and Facebook. Petrus Peregrinus de Maricourt. Throughout the late 19th and early 20th centuries, a debate over the Middle Ages by scientists was discussed. The debate concerned whether science had flourished during the Middle Ages. Pierre Dume wrote a book called The History of Science, fostering the idea that the Church contributed to the advancement of science. Other scientists insisted that the Church was a hindrance to science. Old ideas of inductive reasoning seemed to be an issue among these debates. Most of what science is today aren't tested with inductive reasoning through experimentation. During the Middle Ages and into the Age of Enlightenment, it was a major part of science. Petrus Peregrinus de Maricourt, during the 13th century, experimented with magnetism which he used to improve the astrolabe and creating the universal astrolabe, making navigation of the sea easier for maritime sailors. Petrus Peregrinus de Maricourt was also known for his work with the freely pivoting compass needles, which also made it easier to navigate with dry compasses. Petrus was one of the first scientists who believed in perpetual motion, which could also be referred to as free energy. This was brought to you by The Strange, The Bizarre, The Unusual, I Like It. On YouTube and Facebook. We thank you for your participation. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, share, make comments. We love feedback.